My name is uh, Father Kevin Mack, Tom Mack's son, back in the village today, and it's great to be here for the Rosa Clare Festival. And above all, it's great to be in the shop where I was reared and where many, many people came in here for stories, for hospitality and generosity from Tom and Mary. Here in the village of Cora Clare, we've just had an incredible, beautiful parade a very enthusiastic parade and a current parade as well and huge effort went into it and the largest number of floats that I've seen in the parade for quite a while. Uh, this home is open today, this was the shop, Tomac's shop and I'm Tomac's son uh, and I'm you know really proud today to, and he would have been proud, I'd say there's bonfires in paradise tonight at just the uh, level of involvement and commitment and he would be really thrilled to see such a huge crowd as well uh, watching the parade and a huge crowd participating. We have something magic in rural Ireland. It's not up to a government to keep it going, but the people that will keep it going. Those that are making tea here today, bringing in fresh corny cake as well. There's a few strawberries. People who will be here during the week just again to welcome and let people come in and have a chat. People who stood today and clapped as things went by. John Carey today, who's been with the festival for so many years, bringing enthusiasm and joy and inspiration into it. It doesn't happen by itself. People have got to get involved. And we still have a festival. Let's keep it going. And I hope that more will get involved and just don't leave it to the one or two. Tomac would be very proud with today. The 40th did justice to it. And again, as I said, there's bonfires up there. Well done to all involved. <laughs>